You know, as most things go in my life, I can't find the GoPro right now. So I uh, went out yesterday to a uh, gentleman who called me and he had uh, stated that his belt kept slipping off. I wanted to know why. And I said, well, I don't know unless they come out and I look at it. But maybe the belt's worn, stretched. I actually think the belt's probably okay. It's got a little, a little burn to it, but... I think that would make a good spare. Well, maybe not. I mean, I've seen worse, but... Uh, first thing I noticed was... This spindle leaning forward like that. Second thing I kind of noticed was... Someone definitely uh, did some uh, welding to that, uh, that unit. And the third thing I had noticed here was... This spindle is missing a grease fitting. I want to rob the grease fitting from the... Uh, unit here. I think we'll put a little red Loctite in there and uh, we'll pull the other grease fitting over there, clean that up and uh, hopefully we have a, uh, I mean somebody definitely greased it, that was nice of them, but uh, we'll, uh, we're waiting for a, a new spindle from Scamazon right now. Uh, so what happened here was uh, and you can kind of see there it caught something and it broke that whole spindle out so be uh, be cognitive of what's in your yard when you're mowing kids animals other objects and uh, be safe we'll get this guy fixed up he'll be mowing again in, uh, at least in a couple days here so it appears the hardest part here is going to be actually removing the broken pieces so hopefully I don't have to grind them out but we're uh, right now I'm having some trouble finding my vice grips but here's the uh, carnage from that and uh, you can see right where something hard was caught uh, and thankfully nobody was uh, beat up or hurt, but that kind of crap happens. So we did get those pieces out. Uh, we'll give it a quick scraping uh, just to get rid of some of that excess grass. But uh, I think uh, we're almost done with that one. 